Okay, so I figured out how much of an impact running the day before a big run does. It took me two hours, six minutes roughly to do a half marathon today. Um, I did slow down heaps uh, and got a walk for a little bit. Um, so it's a good training day today for me. So I guess for anyone watching these videos, you can hear my advice, don't run the day before a big run. I'm going to really try to stick to my marathon training program now. So that'll be Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. That'll be a mix of different runs. They're not going to be long runs on those days, I don't think. Then Friday, Saturday, rest days. I don't think I'll do any running at all at park runs. Um, most I'll do is like photography, uh, tail runner. I'll try some of the other uh, volunteer positions for a while. Be nice to do those. Um, yeah. I've gone down in Addenborough Street. I don't know, it was some weird name. You never see it when you're driving past it at 100 k's an hour. Uh, so this will meet up with Switchback Road, and then I've got the final hill climb. There's some cows for you. At least it's a whoop, I need a point properly. Cows off that way, trees, big open paddocks, hill. I'll get there eventually. Um, so I'm only going to walk for another. 500 odd meters and then I'm gonna finish this run up Seen a few different birds out here now uh, A few plovers. No! No! I'm not here to feed you Look at this They're all coming over Wow, poor things. Are you here for my encouragement? They're running faster than me. <laughs> You've been rolling around in the mud, haven't you? It's like, ah, oh, poor things. Yes, hello, hello. Hello. Your owner probably wonders why you're coming over here. I'll let you be. Bye bye. Not the safest way for me to cross roads, but no one ever comes here. Besides the cows, they're still following me. They're getting some exercise too. It's been a long time since they've seen someone walk on this road. So come on, you can do it. You can do it out of a boy. I think it's a boy. I'm just guessing. You can't follow me much further. Your fence gets blocked off there. But look at all the nice grass you've got. So the music I've been listening to today 
is I've listened to one album, uh, Cradle of Filth's new album. Uh, can't remember what it's called. Kylie from the old MSN chat room days, my friend, uh, introduced me to one of their songs the other day and I loved it. Uh, Blackest Magic in Practice. Very good song. It's got awesome guitar work. I love it. And it goes for just over six minutes, which is good. I love my lawn songs. Um, right now I'm listening to something completely different. Uh, hard Bass Chapter 21. So it's all the duff 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 music. It's not really encouraging me to go much faster. Just enjoying it. Uh, yeah. I didn't say goodbye to the chaos. Yeah, well, I'll see him next time I come here. Two hundred and fifty meters, and I'll get going. My uh, thing broke in the uh, car today, but it still seems to. That's a peewee, Australian magpie lark, just magpie lark, or just peewee. So last couple of days into August, I've done a five kilometre run, followed by a 2.6 kilometer um, run in the rain at Park Run Inverloch. I've done a bunch of kilometers this morning as well. I've done probably five to seven, I'm guessing. And uh, now I'm up to 20, 90. So, 100 metres and I'm going to keep it get this run over with, get some lunch, have a bath, sit in my house for the rest of the day, and do some studies. I should do some studies. That would be a good idea. on Tuesday during my uh, lunch break. It's going to be different from what I've done the other day. It's going to be consisting of 30 second intervals with one minute uh, rests. So I think I'm going to really try and gun it for those 30 seconds. I want to do it faster than what I was doing with the one minute um, intervals. Day is a easy day, and then one more fart leg after that, which will be two minutes with one minute recovery. So I think that one's going to be really hard. Doesn't that sun just make this area look nice? Those nice dark clouds, sun brimming out the green in the field. And welcome swallows, and I think I did see one yellow rumped thornbill, but that seems to have gone. What's that?
but very wrong. Ah, here we go. There's that thornbill, just on top of that post right there. Well, it was there. Anyway, it's time for me to be there. Bye-bye.